What's up guys? Welcome to today's episode. We're getting packed up. We're headed back to London from Brighton and I gotta get my suitcase organized. So I have some room, but that's all my dirty stuff, which I probably have to fold because it takes up more room if it's just in clumps. And then I have a bit of stuff still in our bedroom over there. So I need to bring that in. So I'll do that first. I just had breakfast. Same as usual, so I didn't show you guys. I'm making eggs and stuff every morning. And we are so incredibly lucky because I'll show you guys outside. It's insanity. Let me see if I open the window how windy it is. Oh, it's not that bad. But look at the water. It's super wavy and it's cloudy today. So we picked the perfect day to drive. So we don't waste the day all the days we've been here exploring it's been beautiful yay all done just gotta close it there we go oh crap damn it <laughs> come on there we go boom all right now we gotta bring these down the long staircase so i tweeted it out just now guys it's so sad to be leaving brighton but at least whoa I thought there was an arm to this couch, but I forgot it was just a cushion, I almost fell. But it's nice that we're going back to London, and not quite home yet. We still got a few more days in London. But it's sad, I love Brighton, it's so beautiful. Let's say goodbye to our flat. Bye. Bye. This was our room. So cute. You're gonna miss it. It's so beautiful. <laughs> But really guys, it was an awesome place. Had a blast staying here. So we're back in London now in the Uber. We just dropped off the rental car. There was a lot of traffic on the way up here. There was an accident on the main highway and it backed it up for like 30, 40 minutes of time. We're good, I'm just gonna have some lunch here. My sandwich that I made earlier. I'm starving, and my water. How's your nap, Alex? It's good. Still tired? Uh, but I'm excited to go see what the new hotel looks like. I know it's in a good location because we walked by it when we were in London, before Brighton. So I know where it is, I just don't know what the inside looks like. We just got to the hotel here in London and the room's not quite ready yet so they decided to offer us some food and drinks so we ordered. I got a green juice, Alex just got a hot chocolate, and Viv got a, what'd you say? Cappuccino. And you guys just went for lunch so that's why you didn't get any food or anything. And I was in the lobby editing while they went to eat lunch and we're just waiting for the room to be ready. So now we're back in busy, bustin' London city. Heck of a lot more crowded than it was down in Brighton. Wherever you want. This is Oxford Street? Uh, let's go this way. Check out what's going on down here. Check out the view. Alex used to make fun of me because when she first started vlogging and I was on the channel, I used to always say, check out this. And I'd say, check out the mountain, check out the view. <laughs> I do it every now and then, but I used to say it all the time. And so I just did it on purpose to make a joke. Ooh, let's go to Ben's Cookies. What a difference, eh, that like an hour and a half drive makes from walking in Brighton to walking in here. Yeah, it's two and a half if there's traffic. Oh my God. Like it, there's so many people here. Look at the streets. Look at this, it's just busy, busy, busy. Yeah, it's like the British New York. It's crazy, it's so full of people. Yeah, except London was here first. <laughs> New York's the American London. <laughs> That's more appropriate. I literally just found out now that HMV stands for His Master's Voice. I had absolutely no idea. That's what it stood for. Alex found her heaven. Jo Malone, her favorite smells. I wonder if they have the one she likes that they discontinued in some places. This mall is a zoo. This is insane. <laughs> There's so many people, oh my god. All right guys, we're making our way to Big Ben because we're gonna go check it out with Alex's mom. She wanted to go see it. This beautiful park we're walking by. Beautiful little like gazebo. Alex was saying this would be a beautiful place to get married. It's true. It's really pretty. Beautiful park. Nice, eh? This is so nice. It's so cute. Big Italian flag there. I bit my lip by accident. Oh no, are you okay? I'm hurt. Look at this fountain. Take a it's so cool. I've never seen a fountain like this before. It looks really cool from far too. It's like smooth. Wow, that's sick. Where does the water come out? I don't know where it comes out from. 
Maybe it comes out from everywhere. That's cool. How lucky are we with the weather? Yeah. Starbucks! It's not mine, it's Alex's. Beautiful day to go through the park. We're back in the Royal Parks like we were last time. Yeah, it's gorgeous out. And we're gonna make our way through the park down to Buckingham Palace again. And then from there to Big Ben. It's a lot busier than when we came the first time, eh? Well, we didn't come through this park yet. Uh, yeah, we'll go down the middle. Yeah, we filmed on the benches over there, your, your out outfit thing. Oh, it's here? Yeah, because we walked down this street and then we went over there. What park is this? I don't know. It's a Lewis Lewis Park. <laughs> With the swing set, I go really high. Guys, you need to watch that video. We'll link it down below. I feel like every video we link a funny video. <laughs> it's always classic YouTube videos too, like things from 2006, 2007 that are just so funny. So check it out down below. Click the link, watch the video. Oh god, look how gorgeous this is. Wow. God, it's beautiful out. Guys, look at this. That is so beautiful. The sun coming right through the trees. Wow. And look, we're at the palace again. So I didn't notice this the first time, and this is cool coming the second time, but anyways, here's the palace, the fountain, but you can actually see, you can see Big Ben from here. It's right there. I didn't notice that the first time. We made it! It's so beautiful! Wow. So surreal, just being here. We gotta cross though. We gotta wait for no cars. All right, let's go. Get across, get a better view. Oh, amazing. Oh, watch out for the bus. I don't know why he's stopping. Yep, okay, we're good. Look at this. Oh my God, it's so cool. All the churches. It's beautiful. Wow. Again, it's so cool to come back for the second time. Plus this field isn't filled with that uh, like pep rally strike they were doing. You can really appreciate it now there's less noise. Oh my God, it's so cool. It doesn't work. I wanted to try to make it grow out of my head. Can't even see it. It's so cool being here. Oh my god. You can't see it in the background though, it's too white. But there we go, we get the whole background. Now we have a much better view of the London Eye than we did in the Uber. Hey, you're ruining my video, car. <laughs> Just kidding. But yeah, it looks really cool. Haven't seen it from this close yet. We're gonna see if we can get even closer. Just take a moment, look. To soak it all in. Look at all this stuff behind us. Whee! You having fun? Mm -hmm. Happy to be here. Why yeah. to pee again? again? Oh no. Look at how cool this is, guys. The current's surprisingly strong, too. This is really cool with the sun. This looks cool. I thought it was gonna ring. Well, I guess not. It's gonna ring? Like, do six dings. But I guess not. Yeah, there we go. That means it's six o'clock. Time to go to Hyde Park and ride the bikes. So apparently we're in the beautiful part of London right now. <laughs> Is this near Harrods? It looks like it's near Harrods, but I don't know. Not familiar enough with this place. Ooh, almost. <laughs> They're trying to do skateboard tricks and film it, and he almost hit Viv before. But they're, they're doing pretty good. We'll see if we can catch one here. I think I got that. So this is the house we caught a glimpse of, well house, building we caught a glimpse of last time walking by. It's gorgeous. Oh, the Tudor style is just amazing. Really, really cool. So we found another pub to come to called the Argyll Arms, and we're lucky because they stopped serving in about a half an hour. Some real authentic pub food again. I got sausage and mashed potato, but I wanted to try some mac and cheese. Alex got a potato and spinach pie. 
Yeah, Mashed that looks potatoes. unbelievable. And we've got mac and cheese and chips. That looks unbelievable. So this is where we came for dinner. Argyle Arms Nicholson's. It's right here near Oxford Street beside this steakhouse. Amazing food. I'm really disappointed though that I didn't film the outside of yesterday's pub in Brighton because that food was amazing. And now I can't remember what it was called. I'm so mad I didn't film the outside. I know, I tried looking today on Google Maps because I remembered what was beside it for some reason. Well, because it had an easy name, Black Lion. It was right beside the Black Lion. If you guys are from Brighton and you know what's beside the Black Lion, the other pub, it, yeah, it was literally right beside the Black Lion. If you know what that is, leave it in the comment section so that I don't go crazy. All right, guys, so we're gonna answer a question of the day and I'm gonna pick one that I've been seeing very frequently. It's just always been like number two or three in which one we decide to pick and it's from Tana, Tana, I don't know how to do that Tana? accent on the A. It's T-A-I-N-A -A with an accent. I don't know how to pronounce that. And then Castro, last name. And her question has been, for the longest time, where do we see ourselves in 10 years? So I will be 36, well, 35. I'm almost 26. Um, oh, hopefully, like, married, kids, owning a house. I don't know where living. Probably still around the Montreal area, but possibly not. Uh... But yeah, I guess that's pretty simple. You know, kids, family, that kind of stuff. Still doing this whole YouTube thing and maybe evolving it into something bigger. Like, who knows? I don't know. That's a long time to think. 10 years. But that's a very interesting question. I hope, I hope above all, we're just happy and healthy in 10 years. Like, we're still living a happy, healthy lifestyle in 10 years time. What do you think, cutie? In 10 years, I see myself single, no kids homeless, like living not even close to Montreal. So yeah, that's where I see myself in 10 years. You're such a dork. As far away from you as possible. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, for real, probably same thing. Guys, don't I look like that girl from Recess? Do you know what I'm talking about? No, I don't know which one. The one on the glasses? I feel like I look like her right now. I like these, they're cool. I'm like a scientist slash that girl from Recess. Um, but yeah, probably same thing. And like having my own clothing line. Yes. That is for 10 years on the to-do list. Guess what's gonna be there, guys? My goal, simple, Great basic <laughs> clothes that are affordable, but really soft yeah. and last a while. Lots of gray sweaters. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got about a day and a half left here in London, so check out tomorrow's video if you want to see more of our time spent here in London. Hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Thank you so much. If you're still watching up to this point, you are the best kind of friend because Call you're watching. Pine tree. If you are. Pine tree. If you're still watching right now, comment pine tree down below. Thank you so much for being here and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.